the SEC from Fayetteville, Arkansas. Our matchup, the 13 and 8 Razorbacks of Arkansas on their home floor being introduced right now, set to go up against the number two team in the country, the Florida Gators, who've won 10 straight. They're 8 and 0 in conference play, and they've won four straight in SEC action. Qualls and Patrick Young, and it's Florida controlling of any ball screen action that Florida threw at it. Marshawn Powell, what a way to open. He's been shooting pretty oh, well. Wade, and he knocks down a three. For a team that hasn't been shooting well outside the arc, quite a start. Got to him inside and can't. Wade will take the three. Got it. He's not been shooting well out there either, and he's got two threes in his first three shots. He gets check in for the Gators. He's on Powell defensively, and Powell turns and fires over him. Clark on the drive, up and under and in. Nice follow by Cody Clark. And he'll have a chance. Here is Powell, and he's going to go straight up with it. And got it. Marshawn Powell off to a great start. With seven, when you come out of this, Nicholson will clear the rebound. Balls, it's down to three. This is the biggest deficit of the year. Tyler Rosario had it stripped from behind. Outlet pass ahead to Young. And now a for the slam. Billy might need a timeout here. Pass inside. Williams. Ja'Cory Williams. And the lead is 15. Arkansas has a good rhythm against this zone. Very good rhythm. B.J. Young, that's pretty good rhythm, too. 26 to 10. ESPNU starts things off for signing day early tomorrow morning. And you can watch all day long. I think we've got 18 hours of coverage. Another three goes for Ja'Cory Williams, and it's just a 16-point Arkansas lead. Biggest deficit that Florida has faced this year, and they throw it away again. And it continues to swell. The Hogs' lead is up. Young guarded by Wilberton is going to go straight up with it. And got it from three-point land again. If you ever wanted your medal tested, if you're Florida, you're about to find out. Powell weaving through traffic all the way to the rack. Tipped in by Williams. There's an open look for Matt. Got it. Uh, again, just great offense by Arkansas, Brad. Patient. The line underneath is a good one to Mickelson. Time. Up by 17 at home. Arkansas couldn't have been much hotter. Loose ball. First one goes to Arkansas, and the lead's going to get up there. Just like Cody Clark got up there. Florida's eighth turnover turns into an easy deuce to open up the second half for the Hawks. And another turnover. And now Powell lobs. Baseline jumper. Michael Qualls. The lead's back to 23 again. And another Gator turnover, three straight. Trap in the corner. They cross court at three to shoot. They might not get one away here either. They do, and he hit it. Wow, Michael Qualls the last second. DJ Young, tough jumper, followed there by both Nicholson and Ja'Cory Williams. I'm not sure who they're going to give credit. I think Corey Williams. Big number 21, a touch. You said earlier he can hit from out there. The walk-on captain from right here in town. Comes up short arms and out of the end. 
Missed a couple of layups. B.J. Young leading through traffic. Leads it to Nelson. Turn it over again. Start fighting. That's a very good, very good suggestion. That problem is, Arkansas tonight has been too hot from the floor, almost the midway point of the half, and they're up 21. Kenny Boynton had it stripped. Back come the Hogs the other way. B.J. Young. At Arkansas is they are so alert in this game and it has been from the opening Murphy had it stripped Florida continues to turn it over Arkansas continues to make those kind of plays Cody Clark airborne 27 point lead Number two is not on the ropes. Number two, half their body is outside the ring. <laughs> That's got to be in the running. For time. Balls. There is a jumper. No, not too much. Powell inside. You tell me, who's been the quicker team the entire ball? Well, you got him right there. Florida had him. On the baseline. Oh, I don't want the crowd back up. Balls. When the ball got to the middle of the floor, bam! In Bud Walton by 24. And they do it in stunning fashion. Over the number two team in the country, 80-69 Hawks. <laughs> 80-69 is the final. Coming up next, top ten showdown in Ann 